Jen. Welcome to our kitchen classroom. Today we will be showing you how to add fractions using pizza. This is a whole pizza. We can slice this pizza into different equal parts to make fractions. If we slice our pizza like this, we get eight equal parts. One of those pieces could be considered one-eighth of the pizza because it is one piece out of eight. The top number or numerator tells you how many slices you have. The bottom number or denominator tells you how many slices the whole pizza was cut into. Some fractions may look different but are really the same. For example, if we cut one half of the pizza into two pieces, it's still half of the full pizza. Or if we cut one half of the pizza into four pieces, those four pieces are still equal to one half of the full pizza. Adding fractions with the same denominator is very simple. It's like adding the same size pieces of pizza together. If a pizza is cut into six pieces and you have two pieces left, you have two sixths of the pizza. If your friend gives you three more pieces, how many pieces do you have? That's right, five pieces of pizza, or five-sixths of a full pizza. Notice that the numerators were added together, but the denominators stayed the same. That's because the denominator represents how many pieces the whole pizza was cut into. The numerator tells us how many of those pieces we have. By adding pieces to my plate, I didn't change how big the pizza was or how many pieces we cut it into in the beginning. If you add 4 eighths of a pizza to your friend's 5 eighths of a pizza, what happens? Together you have a total of 9 pieces, or 9 eighths pizza. Did you notice that 9 eighths is more than one full pizza? 9 eighths is equal to one full pizza plus an extra piece or one and one eighths pizza. Congratulations! Now you know how to add fractions with pizza.